Hey everybody, Collector Cousin here, and today I'm going to open up some blister packs from the upcoming set, Chilling Rain. The street release for this set is actually June 18th, but I was able to get them one week early from Walmart. I guess the stalker from MJ broke the street release date, and that's good news for me because I was able to buy these 25 Chilling Rain blister packs, and I actually bought them at different weights to see if the set is weighable. I already organized them from the lights packs over here to the heaviest ones over here and I basically want to see if there's a correlation between the pack weights and the type of cards you can pull. So back in the day it was really easy to weigh these cards. There was one type of code card, the white code card. Now there's a green code card which gives you nothing in the booster pack and a white code card which gives you at least a hollow and uh, that makes it really difficult to weigh but we'll see if we're successful in weighing them today. So I'm going to push all of these 25 blister packs up and I'm going to turn on my scale here and of course I'm going to calibrate it with this 100 gram weight. If you guys are interested in weighing, the link for the scale I use is in the description down below. Okay, 100 grams, perfect. And we're going to start with the lightest packs here. This Galarian Articuno pack weighs in at 31.76 grams. Okay, it's pretty stuck in the pack. So of course there's variations between all the blister packs. You can see that this one was really glued in there. The amount of glue they use also adds some variation to the weights. The pack weighs 22.34 grams. And let's see what's inside. A white code card. Okay, so we're gonna start out with a good card. We have a reverse. Inteleon, and we have something good, a Celebi V. Really good, that's the first ultra rare. I was hoping for something better, but um, we're off to a weird start because the Lice Pack gave me an ultra rare. So the next light pack weighs in at 31.79 grams, 22.38 grams is the weight of this pack. And to save time, I'm not going to do the card trick again. I have 25 packs to open up. That's a lot. And a white code card. Okay. And we have a hollow Cresselia. Yeah, 25 packs is a lot to go through. This next light pack weighs in at 31.82 grams. 22.38 grams. Pretty much the same weight as the previous booster pack. And let's try not to spoil this one another white code card and we have a leopard V so let me grab a sleeve for this I am gonna leave some code cards in the comment section down below so be sure to like this video and subscribe okay let's see what the weight of this blister pack is 31.90 grams and the individual booster pack weighs in at 22.50 grams a little bit heavier Is there anything good in this booster pack? There is something good. We have a white code card and we have a Shadow Rider Calyrex V. Nice, I would rather have the alt card, but I'll take this. So it looks like all the light packs give you all the ultra rare pulls. All right, let's take another look at this Shadow Rider Calyrex V after I sleeved it up. Would much rather have the alt card. This next pack weighs in at 31.84 grams, a little bit lighter than the previous pack. The booster pack weighs in at 22.38 grams. And is there anything good? A hollow, another white code card. So, so far the trend is the light packs give you the white code cards, which is interesting. 31.83 grams. So this is interesting. The lighter packs give you the better pulls. So instead of picking out the heaviest ones, you want to pick out the lightest ones. This one weighs in at 22.39 grams. And let's see if there's anything good inside. A bottom of the snow and our first dud, a green code card. Okay. These packs are going to be a little bit heavier, 31.91 grams, 
22.51 grams is the weight of the pack. And there are so many cards in this set, too many if you ask me, but there's a lot of good looking cards, like the, those alt art cards that everyone wants. I really want that shiny Snorlax. A green code card, so that means we have nothing. We have a, we have a reverse energy and a Scolipede. Okay, let's get the next pack. Next pack weighs in at 31.91 grams, 89 grams, around there. The pack weighs in at 22.42 grams. And green code card, which means nothing. Okay, this one weighs in at 31.91 grams. 22.53 grams. And I think I spoiled myself with a reflection. And I saw that green code card. So if you guys got to this part of the video, here you guys go. This is a code card. I don't know if you can use it yet. You might have to check back on June 18th when the set drops. And no card trick. Let's see what we get. A reverse frost last and just a hollow Tapu Fini. This pack weighs in at 31.97 grams. Okay, let's open up this pack. It weighs 22.56 grams, so the booster pack is pretty heavy. Green code card, not even gonna bother. Okay, 32 grams pretty much right on the dot it fluctuate a little bit that's why it's important to calibrate the scale 22.51 grams let's see what we get white code card okay hopefully we get something good and it's a sandaconda v so far all the ultra rares that i'm getting are just normal ultra rares no full arts no alt arts no rainbow rares no uh, gold cards, which sucks since there's so many of them. 32 grams. 22.49 grams. Green code card, not gonna bother. Because we already know that we're not gonna get anything good. Not even a hollow rare in that pack. 32 grams is the weight of this blister. The individual booster pack weighs in at 22.48 grams. And we see a white code card. And we're going to get something. Hopefully it's a good card. It's a Bliss EV, another normal ultra rare. I'll sleeve this one up, but again, nothing too spectacular there. Okay, this one weighs in at 32.02 grams. 22.52 grams is the weight of the booster pack. A lot of glue here. We have a white code card. And do we have anything good? A Galarian Zapdos V. Again, another ultra rare. But it's not that alt art, it's not the full art, which isn't the best. Okay, this pack weighs in at 32.02 grams. Okay. 22.45 grams is the weight of the pack. Let's see what we get, white code card. And are we gonna get anything good? A Metagross V Ultra Rare. Okay, so these mid-weight packs, you know, some of them are giving me good pulls with the white code cards, some of them aren't. Definitely the light packs were really interesting because almost every single one gave me a white code card. So you might wanna watch out for those lighter packs when weighing. This one weighs in at 22.52 grams for the booster pack. And what do we have? Green code card, nothing great. 32.05 grams. So we're more than halfway through. 
22.56 grams. And green code card. 32.06 grams. 22.50 grams for the booster pack. Let's see what type of code card we have. A white code card, okay. Was not expecting that. And are we just gonna get a hollow? Yep, just a hollow frost lass. 32.07 grams. 22.56 grams for the booster pack. And we have a green code card. This next pack weighs in at 32.05 grams, a little bit lighter than the previous one. Maybe it'll have a white code card. 22.58 grams. And let's see what type of code card. Oh, doesn't wanna come out. Green code card, nothing. I thought maybe it would be something good since it was so difficult to open up. 32.11 grams. 22.57 grams. Green code card, nothing good. 32.09 grams. 22.56 grams. Ooh, white code card. And what do we have? A hollow, Galarian, Hernerigus. I should have been putting the hollows over here. I think I might have skipped like two or three hollows. That way I would have known how many white code cards I got in this a lot of 25. 32.13 grams. 22.60 grams. I think this is a green code card. Yep, nothing good. Two more booster packs left. 32.17 grams. 22.62 grams. And I think we have another green code card. Yep, last pack. Let's see how much it weighs. 32.18 grams. Booster pack weighs in at 22.62 grams, pretty heavy. And the last pack gives us nothing, a green coat. So let me recap the pulls. All right, so after weighing 25 Chilling Rain booster packs that I bought from Walmart, I got these ultra rare pulls, this Metagross V, Galarian Zapdos V, Blissey V, Santaconda V, Leopard V, Shadow Rider Calyrex V, and this Celebi V. So that's a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven V cards. And I also got a couple hollows. So if you guys like this video, be sure to leave a like button down below and subscribe to my channel for more pack weighing videos in the future. Thanks for watching, guys. Collector Cousin out.